First national standard was set to limit forever chemicals that are found in nearly half of the drinking water. Half. Mm -hmm, that's a lot. Here in the U.S., it's a lot. Now experts are calling it a huge breakthrough to help protect your health. Amanda Gaither reveals the dangers behind these chemicals and how you can lessen your exposure to them. They can be found in some makeup, sunscreen, even pizza boxes, a large family of potentially dangerous synthetic chemicals. Plethoracil and polyplethoracil are substances that are known as forever chemicals. Dr. Sanjay Gupta says they're also called PFAS chemicals that can be found in consumer products that are made to be waterproof, non-stick, and stain resistant. These chemicals have been developed at this breakneck pace. And again, they're called forever chemicals because they don't break down completely. Gupta says that means what makes them durable also makes them hard to get rid of. They linger in the environment and the human body. The CDC says nearly 97% of all Americans have these chemicals in their blood. They're linked to a variety of health problems, including cancer, kidney and liver damage, and other serious health problems in people with prolonged exposure. But you can lessen your exposure. You can avoid stain and water resistant products and sprays. If you order delivery or takeout from restaurants, remove your food from takeout containers before reheating. When cooking at home, steer clear of nonstick cookware and filter your drinking water with activated carbon or reverse osmosis if possible. For Health Minute, I'm Mandy Gaither.